Hey guys, it's Noah here with Dragon Rider Network, here with a review of Display Recorder. What Display Recorder allows you to do is record your iPhone screen without jailbreaking. When we open up the app, this is the very simple interface we get. Let's go ahead and take a closer look into the interface. So down here at the bottom we have the record button, to the left of that we have the settings button, to the right of the record button we have the stop recording button, up above on the right we have a view recordings list, uh, at the top left we have a help menu, and at the very top middle we have a timer that shows you how long you've been recording. In the very middle it has an indicator that shows when you're recording and it will start flashing when you are recording. Now let's take a look at the settings menu. The settings menu is basically the only menu you will be using on this app. Um, so basically we have some video settings to help you change the codec and stuff. And same with the audio. Now let's start a recording. So now we're recording as you can see at the top in the green. And now this is the recording of the screen. This also records your voice, um, but I decided to take that out just because I'm talking right now. And we can go ahead and stop the recording. Now we can go into the list to see all the previous recordings. And there is our recording. We can share it. And we can also play it. So now that that's done, we can go ahead and back out of there. And that is basically the app. As you can see, it's very easy to use. Now this app, I give a two and a half out of five stars. The reason being um, is it crashes almost every single time you record and because of the price, it's starting at $9.99, um, so that is a pretty steep price, um, especially for how much it crashes. Almost every recording it crashes, and I was lucky just to be able to get that recording for the video um, to record. The pros is that it's fast, great quality, and easy to use. So I might recommend this app. I would wait for some future updates to come out um, to fix crashing and stuff. But other than that, um, it's a pretty good app. Uh, I hope to see you all next time. Bye.